Good morning, and thank you for making Tiger TV Network your choice for news and information here at Middleton High. I'm Tyler Ward. I'm Azalea Jones, and we are broadcasting on location this morning, Friday, February 3rd, from the Tiger Cafe here on campus. More on that in a moment. We're our top story this morning celebrating Black History Month. February marks the month-long recognition of the contributions African Americans have made here in this society and all over the world. This morning we highlight a trailblazer who's made her mark in law, politics, and is now one heartbeat away from presidency. Reporter Patty Lynn highlights the United States President Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris was born to Jamaican professor Donald Jasper Harris, who taught at Stanford University, an Indian diplomat biomedical scientist, and cancer researcher Shyamala Gopalan. Harris was born in Oakland, California on October 20, 1964. She studied political science and economics at Howard University in Washington, D.C. After graduating college in 1986, Harris went on to earn a law degree at Hastings College in 1989. She became the deputy district attorney in Oakland, California, then advanced to district attorney before being elected attorney general for the state of California. Six years later, she ran for U.S. Senate and won. Four years after that, she called the call of a lifetime. President Joe Biden asked her to serve as his vice president. History was made when the two won the election and were inaugurated Please on January 20th, 2021. She is currently the first I, female vice president, Kamala as well as the first African-American and Asian-American to, to take up the heavy mantle of vice president. That I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States. That I will support and defend the Constitution against all enemies every voice and sing every 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 voice and sing 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 Tiger TV had hoped to include a virtual interview with Vice President Harris. In fact, we were in communication with their office for several weeks, both by phone and email. However, due to national and world events, the Vice President's office reached out to us last week with a final decision on a request and explained, in essence, that the Vice President is unable to participate in our interview at this time. Tiger TV expressed our understanding of the decision and shared that we would reach out again in hopes that the Vice President's schedule would allow for us a future interview. For Tiger TV, I'm Patty Lynn. Tyler, Azalea, back to you on location at the Tiger Cafe. Thanks, Patty. We're filming live on location here at the Tiger Cafe to showcase a special project our TV1 students are working on. They will spend the quarter working on a public service announcement highlighting the Tiger Cafe, students who work here, and how it helps prepare students for the real world. There are plenty of opportunities to volunteer here for service hours. You'll hear all about it once the PSAs are finished. Switching gears to sports news, here's Yasir Blakenley. Wrestling for Middleton started in December, and they have shown improvement, making the whole entire school proud. Last Wednesday was Wrestling Seniors Night, and after that, they have their county championships. And I hear some wins from our Tigers, such as Christian Lugo, Tulani Benko, Chad Bryant, Chase Kendrick, and Jakari Edwards. Reporting for Tiger TV Network, I'm Yasser Blakey, Tyler Azalea, and now back to you in the studio. That's all for today. I'm Tyler Ward. And I'm Azalea Jones. Until then, join us next week. Same place, same time, same channel. Make a great rest of the day in the land of the mighty tiger. Are you excited to make a change? Yes, yes, I am. Let the rejoicing rise. High as the listening skies. When we speak, let it resound loud as the rolling sea. Sing a song full of faith that the dark past has called us. Sing a song full of hope that the present has brought us. Facing the rising sun of our new day begun. Let us march on to victory is won. Stony the road we trod, bitter the chastening rod felt in the days when hope and born had died. Yet with a steady beat, having our weary feet come to the place. For